Hello, I'm Chef Michael McDermott and this is Chef Michael's Food Hacks. Today on Chef Michael's Food Hacks, we're making Cajun Swai with a Cajun sauce. Now in the pot all right now, I have going what's called the Holy Trinity in Cajun cooking in Louisiana. You got 25% bell peppers, 25% celery, 50% onions. It's called Cajun Mirepoix. I also got a little Caribbean spice in there, a little Creole spice. And as you know from the last time I showed you, we're sweating! Look how pretty the ingredients are, alright? Now, also what we're going to do over on this side is I want to show you something with fish real quick. i got to get a fork. Now, this is a cool, cool new fish that I'm messing with. It's supposedly related to the catfish. Now, look at the one side here. See, that is the side that's closest to the fish. This is the side that's further away from the fish, okay? So what you want to do is when you're grilling, which is what we're going to do with this fish, we're going to grill it first this side down, and then we're going to flip it over and do the, uh, the flesh, uh, the uh, inside of the fish, okay? What that does is it just holds together better, okay? Now what I did was I marinated this in a little bit of spices and a little bit of olive oil, and as I said, I'm going to put it that side down, okay? Can you hear the sizzle? That side down. My grill pan is pretty hot. And I sprayed the grill pan too with olive oil. Now I'm just going to mark that and then I'm going to put it inside the grill pan over there. And then I'm going to put it in a 450 degree oven and finish it. It takes about three minutes. Now I can use tomato paste to thicken this sauce, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to use the oven dried tomatoes we made the other day. And you can look up the oven dried tomatoes. On, on the Facebook site, obviously, it shows you how to do it. To dehydrate the tomatoes. You can either do it in an oven or you can do it in a dehydrator. I have one of those bad boys. Okay, so now I added that. Then I'm going to add the fire roasted tomatoes that I like to use, as you all know. Scrape out the pan. All right. Now, what I'm going to do, look how pretty this sauce is. This is what's called a Cajun or a Creole red sauce. It's used for shrimp and mostly uh, other kinds of seafood. If we were in New Orleans, we'd probably either have catfish or grouper. This is a relation to catfish, so we're going to get away with it. Now what I'm going to do is bring this up to a simmer. I'm going to simmer it covered for about 15 minutes, and then I'll show you how to put it all together. Now inside this sauce, we've got the Cajun mirepoix, which is onions, celery, bell peppers. Okay, that's it. That's their mirepoix. Oh my goodness, look at that. Now, if, if that is a meal fit for your family, I don't know what is. This is Chef Michael McDermott, Chef Michael's Food Hacks. Remember to stay tuned for the next Chef Michael's Food Hacks. And remember, when you eat better, you live better.